polar bear is a large carnivorous mammal. Most of the fierce battles that take place come from their own kind. Polar bears fight for territory. 30. The bear's fatal mistakes. The polar bear confronts the ferocious predator. Mother polar bear is leading her babies to find food. Mother polar bear is probing a sleeping seal. The giant seal wakes up to chase away the predators. In front of this huge opponent, the mother polar bear had to take her cubs. A war for territory broke out between two polar bears. The fight becomes more fierce when both of them aggressive towards each other. One of them ran away, but the son didn't give up and still chased. The battle continued. The two rushed at each other fiercely. The battle is finally over. The polar bear has many wounds on his body after the fight. The mother polar bear is standing with her cubs, leading them on the road, suddenly being attacked by a pack of fierce dogs. Before the fierce attack of the dogs, the mother polar bear does not fight back. It just tries to protect her cubs. A grizzly bear is trying to protect his meal from the wolves. With an overwhelming number of wolves, the grizzly bears alone manage to chase these bandits away. Realizing that the grizzly bear's meal could not be obtained, the wolves decided to leave. Two polar bears sit on a cliff for hours, waiting for whales to swim into the river mouth. When it discovers its prey, a polar bear jumped into the water and approached the white whales. While the other one stands on a rock waiting for its chance, it carefully selects its prey. The water rose, the white whales approached, the polar bears easily caught their prey. This is a polar bear hunt. Spotting a seal lying in the sun, the hunter quickly moved. The polar bear is clever, hiding under the ice and leaping up suddenly. Only now did the seals realize and quickly run away. In just a moment, the polar bear took down the prey. The hunter tries to pull his prey to the surface of the iceberg. Polar bears like to hunt alone, and hunts usually take place in winter. The hunter walks boldly into the midst of the seals lying by the seashore. Polar bears struggle to find suitable prey to attack. Polar bears are the largest carnivores on land. Their main food is seals. Polar bears are very picky eaters. When they eat, they shed the skin of the seals and usually only eat the subcutaneous fat. A fierce battle took place. Four bears threatened to attack a wolf. The ferocious bear drags the wolf ashore and tears the enemy apart. The other wolves try to save their fellows by the all means, but in vain against the strength of the bears. It seemed that the danger was not over. Now the mother bear climbed down to check the situation. But immediately the mother bear had to run up the tree because the wolves were aggressive and attacked. Wolves are eating their meal right in the river when a gluttonous bear approached. Understanding the bear's intentions, the wolves became fierce and attacked and chased the bear away. The bear alone managed to find a way to deal with the wolves. Seeing that the bear seemed to have moved away from the meal area, the wolves continued to return to enjoy. However, with his hungry stomach, the bear still defiantly turned back. Normal grizzly bears always try to avoid collisions when hunting. However, the lack of food has caused their behavior to change, becoming aggressive and ready to fight for a meal. 
In the end, the wolves agreed to share the food with the grizzly bear. At Great Smoky Mountains in Gatlinburg, black bears and wild boars have a battle to the death. The black bear grabbed the wild boar's neck and tried to drag its prey up the steep embankment. The wild boar tried to escape the bear's mouth many times, but was still attacked by the black bear. The battle is getting more and more intense. The black bear is biting the wild boar's neck. After a while of struggle, the black bear's strong bite revealed the flesh underneath the skin of the wild boar's neck. A brutal fight between two giant bears when they want to fight for territory. The roars of both giants echoed throughout the forest. Both bears fight each other. Neither side will give up. The fierce fight quickly ended. One of them gave up and left. A fight broke out and two grizzly bears got into a fight on the highway. Both are aggressive, snarling and shoving each other in the middle of the street. After a while, the two decided to fight each other. The better bear won the upper hand and chased the opponent away. A commode bear is standing by the stream looking for food. Commode bear stood on the shore and looked closely. It plunged into the rushing water. But the bear lost its prey. Its fur was soaked. Very soon, the commode caught the fresh salmon in the river. Successful hunting, the commode brings the prey ashore and enjoys the meal. An antelope appeared in the water. The grizzly bear quickly ran up to it. Seeing the bear approaching, the antelope ran ashore and ran into the forest. In the face of the bear's pursuit, the antelope decided to jump into the water to avoid the hunter. After a moment of hesitation, the bear also jumped into the water and approached the opponent. When the enemy approached, the antelope immediately kicked the bear hard. With long legs, the antelope can easily walk in the riverbed leaving the bear behind. Not giving up, the bear is determined to find a way to follow the antelope. The hunter tried to distract the prey, but the antelope knew the bear's intentions and went back into the river. While the bear got to the shore, the antelope swam to the other side to escape from the hunter. The bear suddenly woke up to the sound of a wolf. Realizing the enemy's intentions, the bear quickly rushed to chase the wolf away to protect his food. The hungry wolf discovered the bear's meal, so it refused to give up. The wolf approached the bear looking for the right moment. The bear snarled, not very happy with this thief. The bear pulled out the bait hidden in the dirt to eat it. Without giving the wolf a chance to approach the bait, the bear immediately chased the thief away. Before the stubborn bandit, the bear had to bury the bait in the ground. Refusing to give up, the wolf still lingers for a meal because of the meal. After several unsuccessful approaches, the wolf lay in the distance of another suitable opportunity. The bear went into the tiger's territory by mistake and was discovered by the tiger. The tiger quickly followed the bear's every move. The bear discovered that the tigers were watching him and he quickly ran away. However, the bear still cannot escape the sharp claws and the teeth of the tigers. A hungry bear is roaming for food on the grass. 
the hunter quickly spotted and attacked a baby deer. The grizzly bear grabs its neck and carries its prey to safety. The bear looks quite tired after carrying the baby deer for quite a long distance. Grizzly bears have a large, strong stomach, which makes them able to eat almost anything. They have strong teeth to chew on even hard plants. Usually a bear's menu is berries, mushrooms, salmon, insects and small animals. So young deer meat can be a in very interesting snack. This lion, just because of a moment of inattention, was hit by the wildebeest in the stomach. Rarely do we see such a frightened scene of the lion running away. With the advantage of long horns, antelopes decide not to spare the lion, but chased and killed it. Three lions are approaching the crocodile, lying in the sun on the steppe. Seeing danger approaching, the crocodile immediately counterattacked first. Crocodile alone weighs three, but is still very aggressive and not wary of the opponents. The lion walks majestically, eyes staring in a calculated direction. When the time is ripe, the lion immediately rushes towards the zebras, running the zebra while kicking the lion's hind legs in its face. Will the lion's somersault cause the zebra to be knocked down under its claws? A herd of lions was resting when a South African buffalo suddenly attacked. It rushes madly at the lion in the presence of the lions. Seeing the fierce buffalo full of anger, the lions were helpless to see their fellows being angry by the buffalo. Deer, zebra, antelope running around is a signal that a hunter is starting a challenge. A bad wildebeest was grabbed by the lion. What will its fate be? The lion's leg was probably accidentally injured whilst it was hunting. The wound looks small, but the lion's limp is probably a very serious injury. Remnants of the battle left to this lion are too fierce. The wound on its body is so heavy that you can feel it with every heavy step it takes. A lion is dying as it is slowly running out of life. It is still trying to revive the life deep within itself. Maybe the wound was so severe that it really couldn't stand up. A determined predator meets a tenacious prey. Where will this fight go? The lion tries to cling to the purpose of holding the prey down. Although the zebra ran and dragged the lion and fell, the lion still resolutely followed. I don't know where this war will end. A council bullying between lions is a herd is probably not unusual. The bullied lion will always hurt badly and pathetically. Poor lions are hated or isolated in a herd. The lion seems to be trying to play a game of persistently stalking its prey. Seeing his friend being attacked by an adult buffalo in the herd, he rushed to go and knock the lion away. The lion proudly above looks at the innocent prey walking below. The carefree wild boar roams around the grassland and unaware of the approaching danger. The lion quickly rushed to grab the wild boar, trying in vain to escape. The fate of this wild boar is known in advance. The calculated predator and the carefree prey are always the most anticipated scenes. 
This is a clash of speed between the wildebeest and the lion. No matter how fast the gazelle's speed cannot match the speed of the lion and it becomes another meal. Two lions are trying to chase and bully the weaker lion. It was bitten by its arch rival, the hyena, almost half of its body. The hyena must have been very happy that it had a full meal. A lion is writhing in pain. It is being bitten on the neck by its own kind. Later, another lion came and also attacked the weak, who was lying pitifully on the floor. The lion rose up and resisted weakly. Taking the opportunity to see the enemy is weak, the buffalo herd immediately came to butcher with a few more shots. A lonely lion, full of solitude and is ignoring. Breathlessly, aimless eyes looking in one direction as the lion's surrender is the sign of something. It was badly injured on its tail and its legs are making it unable to walk. It's not clear if it was caused by these two hyenas, but their presence in the lion is now in real danger. Not only two, but the whole herd of hyenas begin to surround the lions now. Those eyes filled with despair must have already foreseen its own fate. The poor lion is dragging little by little, even though its hind legs can't move anymore. The poor little animal didn't know if it was born like this or if it was caused by some evil person. The lion cubs will be living like this is amazing. It's lucky that this cub always has his mother by his side. This is the unexpected confrontation between the herd of wild buffalo and the herd of lions. So, it was a herd of lions who were cutting a buffalo together. So one buffalo decided to rush into a decisive battle. The two sides just growled and threatened each other, but didn't officially enter war. African lions weigh on average 186 kilograms. Females weigh 120 to 127 kilograms. And yet, look at this pitifully thin lion. Maybe it hasn't hunted any prey for a long time. That's why it has this current form. Another confrontation takes place between the Swamp Assassin and the Grassland King. With the crocodile's thick skin, the lion's slap was unharmed, but it also made the crocodile more ferocious and angry. After going back and forth for a while, the crocodile retreated to the water first. The lion is trying to pull the hippo to the shore and enjoy a meal. Then suddenly the crocodile ambushes out of the water to take the lion. The crocodile's probably also eating this bait, so it just wants to chase the lion away. Knowing that being in the water is not an advantage, the lion gave up and ran to the shore. These are the familiar eyes of lions when observing their prey. The lonely buffalo in the wilderness is the right time for the lion to start the hunt. The lion rushed to attack from behind the buffalo's leg, but failed. It's true that not all hunters who go to war will enjoy their prey. The plight of this lion is proof of that. The two antagonists were initially threatening each other by roaring in each other's faces. The python strikes first and wraps tightly around the lion's body. These two eyes are two eyes of the opposites. Careful footsteps with fear-filled eyes. 
the footsteps began to slow down when the hunt was launched. A whole herd of lions attacked from the rear of an adult South African buffalo. When the buffalo entered the water for some reason, the lions did not intend to attack the buffalo anymore. The great hidden predator, the lion is perfectly concealed. Seeing an antelope turn away, the lion rushed to attack. It probably didn't expect it to be one who launched the attack, but the antelope turned back and responded vehemently. Seeing the battle was not in his favor, the lion had to stand still and watch the antelopes leave. Here is why you shouldn't go alone into the wild world. This lone buffalo has been targeted by two lions and surely only a miracle can save it now. Miracles happen when a herd of buffaloes appeared and came to rescue his friend from two adult lions. An unfortunate red fox has come into the sights of the bold eagle. An eye-catching dive of prey from the air. With the sharp claws of an eagle, the red fox could do nothing but obediently accept its fate. Alaris Marinus is pecking at its prey with its beak. It must have been so hungry that it tilted its head and swallowed its prey whole. Can't imagine a bird that can swallow prey so fast. The snake-eating kite is a large bird of prey, mainly living on the ground. With the advantage of long legs, it easily tramples the small rabbit under its feet making the rabbit no longer have a way to escape. The eagle is leisurely spreading its wings in the air. On the water, the greaves are cuddling each other. Precise water landing steals prey in a minute. It grabs its prey with one leg and can still fly so fast. The eagle is indeed a killer in the air. A poor wolf has unfortunately fallen into the claws of these two golden eagles. When the wolf tried to bite his teeth at the eagle, the eagle also responded when he took the little wolf's tongue with its beak. Again, the purposeful landings of the eagle on the ground. It's too dangerous at this time, the eagle's target is a baby sitting alone in the park. Fortunately, the mother found out and the eagle released the baby before it flew any further. Although smaller than a black dog, the eagle is still very aggressive and has no fear at all. It always responds fiercely to each black dog's attack. Another mountain goat unfortunately caught the eagle's eyes. Even if he tried to hold on to the cliff, this goat could not match the strength of the eagle trying to pull it up off the cliff. With the old move, the eagle always picks up the prey to a sufficient height and then lets the prey fall freely in the air. After the free fall from that height, this mountain goat must have no hope of living anymore. Now the eagle just needs to fly down and enjoy the result. The average flight speed of a bold eagle is 120 to 160 kilometers per hour. And the speed of a goat is only 40 kilometers, so it can't compete with the speed of an eagle. Perhaps this goat is less fortunate than the goats in the herd when it was pinned under the eagle's claws. Refusing to succumb to the eagle's claws, the goat always tries to run and find a way out. The goat dragged the eagle quite a distance, but it seemed that the eagle is no less competitive when it's determined to cling to its prey. The competition of endurance of these two preys will never come to an end. The lizard must have to run away because it saw the danger. No matter how fast you are, you can't escape the eagle's claws. 
The helpless Blackfruit was targeted by an eagle from a distance. Another perfect landing from the eagle, within minutes it caught the crow. The crow is also very ferocious when he also responds fiercely, even though he is weaker. Even if they respond, it won't make a different ending for the crows. Optimistic water snake swimming in the ocean. In the air, this eagle is also probing for any prey for today. The moment this water snake comes to the surface will be a moment it regrets for most of its life. Accurate in every centimeter when the landing on water, the eagle immediately stole the water snake. Now it just leisurely steals its prey to a peaceful place to eat. It brought back its children to enjoy this prey. When this eagle lands close to the ground, I always think that they have hit the target and will kill the prey. But it just came down and roamed with the little fox. An eagle, when it begins to fly low, is when it's reached its target. It seems that it just wants to play with the dog below and doesn't want to catch this animal. High above the eagle spreading its wings slowly approached the two mountain goats on the rocky slope. The eagle's outstretched wings show just how powerful it is. Immediately aiming for the mountain goat, the eagle grabs it and drags it down the slope. Following the slope, the eagle took the mountain goat and dragged it for a long distance. The white pelican is known for its distinctive long beak and large throat pouch. Once in the mouth of this bird, the prey is, looks like it's been locked in a sack with no way out, only accepting its fate. The fox is very eager to catch its prey. He did not expect that so quickly he was also in the sight of an eagle in the distance. Perhaps in any species in the same flock, there is always a fight. Obviously, they could share their prey with each other, but they didn't choose that and went into battle. This is when the wolf comes and just chases the lonely eagle away and freely eats. The wolf immediately rushed over and grabbed the eagle's leg as a warning to chase the eagle away and this prey is his. So far, the hawk has always been the eternal enemy of the chicken. From where did the falcon invade the rooster's burrow? With the instinct of a mother, she decided to fight the hawk and end to protect her chicks. The eagle's visual fossa has a one million cones per millimeter. Because of that, the eagle's eye can see even a mouse at 1.6 kilometers away. So, it's not surprising that every time they land, their prey is always in their claws. For some reason, these little pigs don't have their mothers around. Without the mother pig by their side, these piglets are a lucrative prey for predators like eagles. It won't be difficult because these piglets are no match for the eagle. Stealing prey at the eagle's feet while walking proudly. Perhaps a war is about to break out between the king cobra and the owl. The snake has always been in an attacking position, just waiting for the cat to dive and the fight will officially take place. The cobra took the initiative when it attacked the owl directly. It squeezes its prey for a while and then quickly releases it. Maybe it doesn't want to take the owl's life. 
The swarm of fruit surrounded it, but there was nothing aggressive the eagle could do to save his friend. Even though a very brave crow pecked at the eagle's leg, the eagle just flapped its wings and they didn't care to cough. The resistance of the crow at the feet of the eagle is the resistance of the last will to survive. The eagle is still trying to keep its prey at its feet. The eagle is enjoying its delicious bait. From where does an uninvited guest come to confront the eagle and compete for the bait? It's true that the eagle can't resist compared to its vulture. The chickens were at peace when from the eagle flew down and landed right where the chicken's mother was standing. The eagle's target flocks of the chicks is continuously attacking towards the chicks. But since there is a mother hen here, this eagle hunt seems to be a bit difficult. A lost mother bear is lost in the forest. This once in a lifetime opportunity, the Florida panther quickly rushes to the small side. Despite being small, the little bear snarled and counterattacked. The Florida Panther began to explore more skills and no longer looked down on this little bear. Seeing that the small bear is not easily subdued, the Floridian Leopard also quickly left to find another target. Two lynx were happily playing together when a black bear appeared in the crowd. The mother of the two lynx cubs appeared and saw her pitiful cub and rushed in to attack the little cub. The mother lynx is undressing her cubs with a stroke towards the little black bear. Finally, the mother and son of the lynx family left. Three cunning pointers are hunting for prey in the grasslands. The leader pointer saw the bear from afar and went to the bear up close. Despite receiving scorn from the bear with a grey expression, he still tries to get close to the bear. Because it was so itchy, the bear also turned and snarled towards the cloud. That's how the grey cat was against the war at first, but when he turned around and replied, he also sneaked away and left. Again, different phases between black bears and Florida leopards. These two animals only face each other back and forth, but there is no direct fight on the other side. The Floridian leopard stepped forward and stepped forward again, then stepped back. It seemed like the battle is still quite long. This scene was filmed by a passerby, where two bears are fighting on the street. They stood up straight on their two legs and roared at each other. They still tried to drag each other towards the bushes and continued to fight. It's not often that we see a fight between a lion and a black bear. The lion comes to attack first. Why does the black bear not respond enthusiastically? The struggle of the two beasts didn't go anywhere near the end. A snow leopard is walking along the slopes, glancing towards the mountain goats. The intense chase on the slopes of the mountain is breathtaking. Because the slope was too slippery, the mountain goat fell down the cliff. Unfortunately, there's a stream of water under the cliff, so this is where the mountain goat will be safe. The lion is facing a huge python head on. The python seemed to be very aggressive, as it always attacks the lion first. But who knows that the result of the python becoming the prey for the lion is to tear. The giant python is sure to be a hearty meal for these lions. The tiger jumped up and hugged the bear to hold it under his body. 
Seeing that the situation didn't look good, the black bear in the back also escaped first. The black bear stood up to show its position compared to the tiger. The tiger's trying to bite the black bear's head. The one who has mastered this war from the beginning until now has always been a tiger. After a while, the tiger gained the upper hand, but the black bear also regained his position and responded to the tiger. It frantically rushed to attack the tiger, causing the tiger to be wary and leave. A Floridian leopard is watching from afar and watching the finest movements of the little black bear under the tree. Seeing the right opportunity, the Florida panther quickly rushed down to the small district. Seeing the danger, the little bear immediately rode to the tree, but the bark could not release and it fell to the ground. When he fell, the little bear was very scared and he turned to attack. If the lion's arrogant gaze from above looking down on its prey. When it saw the lion rushing down to this bear, he immediately accelerated and ran as fast as possible to escape. The speed match of the lion and bear material will win. What's the feeling of love when the bear and the lion are on the same dry branch and the lion is getting closer and closer? I can't fall into the water, but it's very smart to know how to row up and sit on the dry log. Although the bear fell into the water, the lion still followed closely to the shore. The lion gave up when he saw his mother on the other side. Such a peaceful and beautiful scene, but there is a conflict between the two adult bears. Suddenly, two black bears rush to fight each other. Usually, they are solitary animals, so for some reason, these two bears happened to meet each other and attacked each other. When tired, the two bears let go of each other and ended the battle here. A grey wolf is trying to bully the little bear with a bigger advantage. Although the grey wolf bites continuously towards the body, the little bear is still very flexible in trying to avoid and find a way to escape. A person was riding a bicycle when he accidentally spotted a bear in the side of the forest. The cyclist accelerated to avoid the bear's pursuit. The situation was very urgent when there was a branch blocking the road so the cyclist had to leave the bike and hide behind the tree. The bear didn't seem to see the cyclist anymore, so it quickly left too. On a background of white snow dyed red with the blood of a deer. The culprit is none other than the lynx, trying to gnaw at the deer. The deer doesn't seem to be dead yet, so it's still weakly resisting. Perhaps now the deer has really surrendered itself to the lynx. This helpless little bear probably didn't know it was being targeted by the tiger. Not only one, but there seemed to be many other tigers who were thinking the same thing. When he saw something strange, the little bear immediately ran forward with his life. But now it's impossible to escape the claws of the adult tigers. The bear looks like it's looking for something. It didn't take too much effort to get a baby deer of its own. It drags the baby deer to a more comfortable place to eat its meal. When he got to the right place, the bear sat down to tear the flesh of its prey and devour it. Belligerent, persistent, tenacious, known as a cold-blooded killer, also known as the warrior dog or gladiator, that is the pit bull. Yet this monkey seems like this monkey still wants to play a game of back and forth with this dog. 
thank you for watching until the end of the video. I hope my video is enough to meet what you're looking for. We always listen and absorb your suggestions to improve the content of our channel. If you find it interesting, please subscribe and comment below my video.